If you're encountering the no internet connection error when trying to export your project in CapCut 2025, here are some troubleshooting steps you can follow to resolve the issue. One, check your internet connection. Ensure that you have a stable and active internet connection. If you're using Wi-Fi, try switching to mobile data or vice versa. You can test your connection by visiting a website or using another app that requires internet access to confirm it's working correctly. Two, disable VPN if active. If you're using a VPN, it might be interfering with the connection to CapCut servers. Disable the VPN and try exporting the project again. Three, check CapCut's server status. Sometimes CapCut may be experiencing server issues or outages. Check the official CapCut Twitter page or use sites like DownDetector to see if others are reporting similar issues. You can also check CapCut's official support page for any maintenance announcements. Four, clear cache and data corrupted app cache or data might cause export issues. Try clearing them. On Android, go to settings greater than apps greater than CapCut. Tap on storage. Tap clear cache and clear data. Restart CapCut and try exporting the project again. On iPhone, Unfortunately, iOS doesn't allow users to clear app data, but you can try uninstalling and reinstalling the app. Long press the CapCut app icon and tap Remove app. Reinstall it from the App Store. 5. Update CapCut check if there is a CapCut update available in the App Store, iOS or Google Play Store, Android. Developers often release updates to fix bugs, including export-related issues. Update the app and check if the export problem is resolved. Six, reboot your device. Sometimes simply restarting your phone can fix temporary issues with the app. Power off your device and power it back on, then try exporting again. By following these steps, you should be able to fix the no internet connection error when exporting from CapCut. If the problem continues, contacting CapCut support directly may be necessary for further troubleshooting.